All right, it's time to feed the scorpions. Please ignore the cups. We'll be using my weed cup that I got from Amsterdam. We will be going species by species, so we're going to start off with the Parabuthus transvelicus. Holy, nice, damn. Instant paralyze. Here goes the second one. I'm using larger roaches, so hopefully we'll get better takedowns because larger roaches tend to struggle more for obvious reasons. Oh, whoa. God damn. Look at that butt. They seem to be getting a little bit nervous every time I turn on the light. Oh, damn. That's insane. All coated in sand now. It's like a marinated roach. Okay. Let's move on to the next one. Let this guy eat in peace. This guy just molted. Check that out. It's a molt. Scorpion molt. Alright, despite the molt, let's just see if he'll eat for us. Yep. Well, I think the molt's about almost a week old. I just didn't bother to take it out. So, he's probably hardened his exoskeleton by now. Alright, this one's the last Parabuthus Transvelicus. After this, we'll be moving on to the Potentota. Come on, Roach, get down. Nope, you're not coming out. Bam. Alright, we'll be starting off with my largest hot and tota. Oh, damn. It's a big roach for him. Alright, here's another one. Whoa. Ooh, chasing it. He knows food's there. Ooh. Not gonna put my hands in there, so there we go. So I'm gonna use my tongs. So I'm not gonna risk myself getting stung by a potentota. Although I'm not really sure what their venom toxicity is. The roach just jumped out of the cup. I didn't even have to let it go. So pretty much it was leaping for its death. Suicidal. Look at the sand that the scorpions kick out of their enclosures. Just making a mess. And it's always the same one. But anyways, moving on, this is the last hot and tota. That was quick. Alright, and now we'll we'll be moving on to the Ropalers Genseus. Why did you let it go? There we go. Much better.
<laughs> I've only got two of these, so here goes the first one. <laughs> what? What? Did you just let go of it? Come on. Here is the second one. There we go. Enclosure seems a little dry, so we're gonna wet one side, half of the enclosure. Because these guys do like it a little humid. Alright, this is the Chinese swimming scorpion, the Lychas muncronatus. There we go. Here goes another one. Hmm. So this guy looks to be needing a rehouse pretty soon. Probably move it to a slightly larger deli cup. Okay, this one's the last one. It's tiny compared to the rest. So um, I guess that'll be it for today's video. So these roaches get to live another day. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.